Well, look, uh, Mike, there have been some interesting developments on the never-ending Manchester United takeover saga uh, because two of our colleagues at The Athletic, David Ornstein and Matt Slater, uh, this evening are reporting that Nasser al Khalifi, who is the president of Paris Saint-Germain, is involved in Sheikh Jassim's bid to buy uh, Manchester United. Now, that would be very, very significant because... Nasser al Khalifi is one of the most powerful men in world football. Uh, he's president of PSG. He is also chairman of the European Club Association. He sits on the UEFA Executive Committee. And also, he's the president of Qatar Sports Investments. Now, that is the sporting investment arm of uh, Qatar's sovereign wealth fund. Now, if he is involved in the takeover, it's significant for two reasons. First of all, it would mean that the president of PSG is also involved in trying to buy Manchester United, uh, which would cause all sorts of complications and difficulties uh, from a sporting uh, competitive point of view. The second thing is, if he is involved, that would suggest that Sheikh Jassim's bid is actually a bid on behalf of the Qatari state because the Qatari sovereign wealth fund uh, would be involved because, as I said, Nasser al Khalifi uh, is president of Qatar Sports Investments, the sporting arm of Qatar's uh, sovereign wealth fund. What we're being told this evening is that uh, two things are absolutely true. The first one is that when Sheikh Jassim first decided that he wanted to bid for Manchester United, he did get in touch with Nasser al Khalifi, And we're being told that there is nothing suspicious about that. It is all above board. Uh, he is uh, Qatari. Nasser al Khalifi is Qatari. Nasser al Khalifi is one of the most powerful men uh, in world football, as I mentioned. So why wouldn't he get in touch with al Khalifi uh, and ask him, for instance, what he thought about Manchester United, whether he thought it was worth paying uh, north of £5 billion for Manchester United? So that is something that did happen. Sheikh Jassim did contact al Khalifi uh, for some advice. The second really significant thing uh, that has happened, which The Athletic have reported this evening, is that the Glazers reached out to Nasser al Khalifi. Now, they reached out to him and met him. And what we're being told is that the reason uh, this meeting went ahead is because a little bit of pressure was being put on Nasser al Khalifi to try and get Sheikh Jassim to increase his bid for Manchester United. Of course, it's been widely reported that the Glazers want £6 billion for Manchester United. Uh, uh, Sheikh Jassim is not willing to offer that kind of money. His bid is worth around uh, £5 billion. So Nasser al Khalifi has been sounded out by both sides uh, by Sheikh Jassim and also by the Glazers. Uh, but people close to Nasser al Khalifi saying, look, this does not mean that he is involved uh, in buying Manchester United. Uh, far from it. He was just asked for some advice.